I don't know how to add text with my video program, so you get to hear my voice. This is my semi-gloss sticker paper, glossy cap print, and semi-gloss folded paper. This is the broken glass holofoam I got on AliExpress. Just roll out and cut the amount you need. It's really thin, so be careful not to crinkle it. Make sure there's no hair or dust in the print. Put the film down, curling towards the print, and line up the edges. I use a tea America laminator that can laminate up to 10 mil pouches. It's set to the highest setting, which is 6. In the product info for the foil, it says it needs to be over 110 degrees, which is probably Celsius. At the lower setting, the foil doesn't stick right to the paper, so I'm guessing it's not hot enough. This is the semi-gloss sticker paper, and the film sticks okay to it. The hollow looks good and doesn't darken the print much. There's barely any blemishes, only some lines and spots that didn't transfer well. For the photo paper, the film doesn't transfer well at all. I use the Canon Photo Paper Pro Semi Gloss 69 pound. When you tilt it in the light, the hollow looks alright, but there's a weird texture that's all throughout the print. For the second photo paper, I tried running it through the machine twice. There isn't much difference and the result is still the same. A weird, noticeable texture throughout the print. This is my glossy print that I ordered from Catprint. The film sticks to it well and has the same result as my sticker paper.